Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Nailed it. Got it. And... Slam. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting that. What's up guys, it's Rancium here, and today we are back in Skyrim, and oh snap you guys, is it going to be an awesome freaking day, but first, if you guys enjoy what you're about to see, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, follow me on Twitter at CouchPotato1898, link is down there in the description, so guys, let's get right into it today. So last episode, guys, we started with the Wheels of Lull, a brand new quest mod that I decided to install into the Let's Play, and guys, let's just go ahead and decide what we're gonna do inside of this, so let's see. Uh, we've already been inside of there, I think, or have we? Uh... Have we already been inside of here? I think we've already been inside of here. What the crap? Did we just come through there? Hang on. This is a little bit strange. I could have sworn we've already been through... Uh, well, that was a, probably a poltergeist. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say that that was a poltergeist. Okay. Only just a tad bit scary. But yes, guys, this place is uh, just a tad bit terrifying. Only just a tad bit scary. But yeah... Very, very cool nonetheless. So we left off last episode trying to find our way through, let's see, we have to find our way to the bottom of Stone Hole Mine, and it was proving to be a little bit difficult because the waypoints were kind of messing up for some reason. It was telling me to go one way and then another way, and it wasn't really, it wasn't really telling me to go the correct way. So I'm going to try and find where to go the correct way. Uh, poltergeists kept popping up for some reason. Um, I actually, I reloaded one of the saves to see if it would fix the, um, fix the waypoints, and I thought it did, uh, and then I went back through this way, and the same poltergeists kept popping up and stuff like that, so, kind of interesting, but we'll see what goes on, let's see, let's try and go back through this same doorway and see what happens, maybe I went back through a doorway that I wasn't supposed to, and we'll see what happens, so let's see, we'll come back through this doorway, we'll go through the canals, and we'll see what happens, because this is this is where we ended off last episode in the uh, in the laser light show area right here. The the poltergeist should show up again. Yep, there's one right there. How you doing, buddy? Time to die. I don't think I'm as scared anymore about these guys because I know what's coming. All right, good stuff. We'll go ahead and come through this little cobweb area right here. All right, and then we ended off like right here. So let's see. And then we came down here. And then it said into the main shaft. Okay, so we don't want to go over there because that was at the top of that waterfall. That's where that was. Okay. So maybe we don't go through there. That's interesting. Interesting. Um, hmm. Is there anything over here? No. Nothing with the mine carts, I don't think. Oh, see. Oh. Hello, secret lever. What did that just do? I don't know. What the hell did that just do? That's kind of interesting. What the hell did that just open? Or did it close something? Let's see. Uh... Do we come down here? I don't think we came down here. No, we didn't. Let's see. Follow the water, maybe? No. Don't need to follow the water. Uh oh, am I stuck? Uh, oh crap. Am I stuck? No, I'm not stuck. Okay, good. Whew! Thought I was gonna be stuck. Okay, let's see. Um, maybe it opened something down here? Let's see. Okay, so yeah, it's telling me to go back down through there. What if we come through here? Can we go through there? No. Okay. So that lever made, it made the ground shake. Did you see that? Let's try pulling that lever again. See what happens. If anything changes... Let's see what goes on. Let's see. Can I equip night vision again? Night vision. There we go. Oh my god, it was on. Really? Holy cow. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's see. Uh, let's go and pull this again. So what does that change? Nothing. I don't think that changes anything, guys. I don't know, you guys. Okay, so 
I tell you what, I'm gonna do a little bit of looking around, doing, trying to do a little bit of, um, whoa, hang on. What the hell? There's like a black spot right there, that's kind of strange. I'm gonna try and do a little bit of figuring out about this whole entire thing, guys. See what's going on with this, uh, see what's going on with that lever and stuff like that. And, um, we'll see what's going on and see if I can't find my way through, guys. And, uh, we'll go from there. Oh, whoa, hang on. What are those? Are those platforms? Oh, snap. Okay, how the hell are we supposed to get up there? Interesting. Okay, there's a walkway, it looks like, like right there. Those must be platforms. They're like ethereal platforms, guys. Okay, is this like a parkour puzzle or something like that? Like, I didn't sign up for parkour puzzles, holy cow. Okay, so I must be missing some sort of entrance. So let's see. There must be some sort of like, um, hmm. There's either like a lift or there's a walkway or something like that that I'm missing to get up to some of these high, like, higher, uh, higher reaching areas and stuff like that. So let's see. Let's try and retrace our steps. Uh, and now I'm stuck. Let's see, am I stuck inside of this area? Um... Well, crap, I think I might be stuck inside of this spot. Well, that's fun. Yep, I'm stuck inside of that spot. Okay, let's just go ahead and get out of this spot right quick. And cheat and, uh, uh toggle collision out of this spot. There we go. And cheat, toggle collision, there we go. Perfect, out of that spot, okay. So let's go ahead and retrace our steps back to like the original spot that we were at because we were right up there. So we came from up there and then we dropped down into there. Or did we come from there? Oh God, I am I am all sorts of turning around. Holy God. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. So those were not there before. That I can pretty much guarantee. So I have to assume that the rumbling that happened whenever we pulled that lever is, uh, were those. That's what was, uh, that's what apparated or something like that. So let's see. Let's come up here and see if there's, a, well, okay. That's fine. Let's come up here and see if there's anything that we need to see because that leads up to, that leads up to the top of the waterfall. Up to the top of that waterfall or something like that. But it doesn't lead to anywhere that we need to go to. There was just, there were just, uh, poltergeists inside of there. So let's see. So, there's nothing up here. What if we come up here? If we come over here... What if we go through here? Okay, so was this not the... This is the area that we came through in the first place. Yeah, this is the complete area that we came through in the first place because... Yeah, there's the mine cart, or the mine track, rather. Did we miss something? Or... Is it... It's just telling us to go outside. Yeah, it's, it's telling us to backtrack outside. That's kind of strange. I don't know why it was telling us to go back outside. Did I miss something inside of here? I don't know why it's telling me to go back out into Skyrim. Reach the bottom of the Stonehole Mine. Apparently, Lovatos is a fabricant, and this object is actually his soul in life force. He has instructed me to head to southwest of Dawnstar. I'm not really sure what is going on. Okay. So, yeah, I don't, I don't think I missed anything. Uh, but I'm gonna continue to try and find a way to get up to those, uh, I guess, platforms. I have to assume that's what those things are. Let's, let's take another look at it together before I cut again and see what's going on. So let's see. The platforms are over there, and we come out right here. What comes down over here? There's a staircase that leads over to here. Okay. We went down. Okay, that leads to nowhere. So let's see, we came down over this way. That I remember because of all the dead bodies. What comes over here? I don't think we came through this doorway. Yep, yeah, no we did not. Because there's a, there's a guy right there, okay. Hello there. I am no fool. Okay, so what do we got through, oh wait. Nope, I thought that was a uh, dark walkway. Minecart alleys, we have not been through there. Aha, aha. Aha! Okay. So we have to wait for a minecart to come through? What do we got? Activate minecart. 
Uh, maybe do we have to run faster than the minecart? I mean, that's not a very... Or do we have to get into the minecart? Uh, I have a feeling we have to get into the minecart. Oh, 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 Jesus, it's gonna kill me. Maybe, maybe, I have no idea. Ow, okay, ow. Oh, the minecart is inside of... <laughs> that's kind of funny looking. Alright, let's see, let's come... Uh, I have no idea what's going on. I have a feeling I have to get inside of that minecart, though. Oh, it's gonna squish me! Activate it! Activate it, you moron! Get in the minecart! No, I need you to get into the minecart. Please get into the mine. Oh, wait. There we go. Okay, so yeah. You have to get... You don't need to get into the minecart. You have to outrun the minecart. Okay. Oh, 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 oh! Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and take some, uh, take some blood potions and heal myself. Okay, there we go. We're making progress now, guys. There we go. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. So we gotta, gotta be faster than the... There we go, the cavern. Is there, Okay, there's nothing else that way. Or is there? Let's see what else... Is there anything else down here? I doubt there is. Nope, there's not. Okay. Ooh, into the cavern. Oh my god, what? Okay. Let's go ahead and get a quick save. Because I feel some deaths coming on, guys. That's a long way down. Okay, uh, wait, is that a jump? That's not a jump. Okay, I thought that was a jump. Whew! That scared me a little bit. This is really cool, though. I'm not gonna lie. This is super cool. Okay, I can't see a dang thing. Do I have any torches on me? Please tell me I have some torches. I have zero torches. God dang it, I can't see. Okay, so it's telling me not to go that way. Okay, there's a, there's a jump. I think. Oh, I fell. Yep, I fell. I couldn't even see! How the hell are you supposed to see? <laughs> oh my god! Okie dokie. So let's see. We're gonna try and be a little bit cheeky. Where is fire breath? We're gonna try and illuminate it with fire breath. So let's see. What do we got? Uh... Aha! Look at you being cheeky. There's a little bit of a walkway right here. Look at you being cheeky. Okay. Freaking puzzles. God dang it, dude. Oh, man. I can't see a dang thing. And this is with night vision on, guys. Mind you. Okay, that made it even worse. <laughs> Still can't see. Now it's just freaking blinding. Okay, nope. I gotta wait. Gotta wait. To okay, there we go. Um, and I really don't have any torches. Are you freaking serious, bro? I didn't bring any torches. Dang it, dude. Do I have anything inside of my dwarven luggage? Where's my dwarven luggage? Nowhere to be found. Perfect. <laughs> Just what I needed. Okay, let's see. Back to fire breath. Alright, perfect. Oh my god, it's a damn good thing I have unlimited shouts. Good lord. Oh my god. Nothing like having to navigate via fire. <laughs> good lord. Okay, we're back on the lit track. Looks like it's a straight shot from here. Alright, let's go ahead and quick save just in case. Okay. Oh! Oh! What the? Oh, I thought that was a train. I straight up just thought that was a train. Scared the hell out of me. Oh my god, my heart was beating so damn quickly. Okay, old mine shaft. Okay. Alright, guys, we're making some progress. This is terrifying. Oh my god. Okay, is there a lantern that I can pick up or something like that? That's what I should have freaking brought was my lantern. Do I actually have it inside of there? Open up. Do I have anything inside of here? Let's see. Please tell me I have something inside of here that will emit some light. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. God dang it. Huh. <sighs> Fine. Be that way. Okay, is there anything up here that's fun? Anything at all? Nothing. Of course. Nothing at all. I would love to find, like, a torch sconce or something like that that I could grab. That would make my life a hell of a lot easier. Okay, anything back here? Nothing. Got some light back there. Alright, anything in these barrels? Salt. Got some currants. And that's empty. Okay. Another quick save. What do we got? Oh. Alright, we have a straight shot. It's okay. 
Looks like then it drops down. Okay, that's that's where we just were. So maybe you were looking for a side alley, perhaps? I don't know, guys. Because that's where we just were, is it not? Or do we have to go somewhere else? Oh, god dang it, dude. God dang it. I think this is the same area. Or not. This one has the the arrow on it. Minecart alleys. Is this just going back to the same spot? Okay. So we're back in the minecart alleys. I mean, it's okay to backtrack, but... Alright. So the main shaft? Maybe we weren't supposed to go through there. Okay, no, we were not supposed to go through there. No, it's it's sending me back to uh, to go back through Skyrim. So we need to get up there somehow. All right, uh, we're back at square one, guys. So let me see what's going on. Okay, you guys. So I have got to adopt the uh, the looking around for much longer than just a brief amount of looking around in in rooms because I missed a lever. And just as I did in the pre in the room previous, uh, I missed the lever to pull for the platforms because it completed the bridge. And now all we have to do is go back up to the entrance and walk across. And there it is. So yeah, I definitely need to do that now. In the mod description, it says it's not it's not a linear it's not a linear nor is it like a, a scripted thing. So you, you there's backtracking, there's all sorts of that stuff. So I have to assume that's why. The, uh, the compass marker, that's why it has it listed going back to outside of Skyrim so that if you, uh, like, forget where to go, um, like, backtracking-wise, because you can get turned around real fast in this place, um, that's how you find your way back. So I have to assume that's what that means. So let's see. We'll come down here. We'll come up here. And there we go, guys. Look at that. There's platforms right here. Look at that. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, that looks nifty. I want to take a picture for that for the thumbnail. That's nifty. Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely going to need to adopt like a, a more thorough searching method. Definitely going to need to do that. That is faux show. Let's see, what way should I take it? I think it should be, I think it should be this way. You get more of them. Look at that. Look at how beautiful that is, guys. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. I love it. All right, awesome, guys. So now, oops, don't want to wait. Okay, perfect. So now we can head across and continue on with the quest, guys. Okay, so now, now that I know we're going to have to explore and look around much, 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 much more and much deeper inside of the rooms and stuff like that and explore every single thing inside of these areas, uh, I'm a little bit more confident about this uh, this mod quest line and stuff like that because look at that, guys. There's a door right there. How perfect is that? So perfect. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and jump up here and let's head in. Okay. So yeah, stuff like this. I, I I completely pass it up because I don't look around. And like, I would probably pass up a lever if it was like right here and I didn't see it or something like that. Oh yeah, by the way, I, I found a torch in that other room. Okay, so let's see. I assume we'll have to pull this lever. Oh god, I feel a sneeze coming on. I might have to, um, I might have to mute. Yep, there it is. Oh goodness, I apologize, holy cow. Okay, so let's see. Um, let's go ahead and take the torch off because it's not too dark, I can see. Let's go and walk through here. We'll be okay. As long as those minecarts do not un- Like that, like that, ow. Holy Jesus. Literally as soon as I said, as long as those minecarts do not unhinge, we'll be fine. And then they unhinge. Okay, round two. Uh, I assume we pull this lever, or do we? How about we don't pull it? Let's see. What if we- can we hop in one of these? Okay, I want to see what happens. Oh, that just queued one up. Okay, okay, okay. Ow. Okay, holy hell, dude. Okay, what the hell just happened? I just completely in- okay. Yep, I don't know what the hell just happened. Okay, so, pull the lever. Uh, whirlwind sprint and run like hell. That's what we're gonna do. That's the game plan. Whirlwind sprint down that whole entire shaft. That's the game plan. Okay, ready? Or, or, 
Here's what we're gonna do, okay? We're gonna play this smart. Okay? Slow time, then whirlwind sprint, because we're cheeky. And we have a limited sprint, and we have unlimited shouts. Ready? Okay. There we go. And... Whirlwind sprint. Yeah. 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 Perfect. Nailed it. Got it. And... Slam. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting that. Good lord, that just set the whole entire place on fire. Okay, that works. Oh, hello, chest. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I opened it. Dragon plate armor. <laughs> I'll take it. You didn't think I... Oh. What is... Okay, well, I guess we fell down a massive hole. And then it immediately filled itself in. Okay. Well, we're down here now, guys. There is absolutely no going back now. Oh god, that's a lot. Okay, let's just go ahead and save real quick. I don't like this one bit. I don't like these guys at all. They're hitting my luggage. Holy Jesus, there's so many of them. Good lord, you have to be at level 15 to do this? I'd say you have to be like level 30 to do this. I mean, granted, they do like no damage whatsoever, but still, you could be like overrun by these guys very, very easily at a low level. And that would be kind of scary for a low level, that's for damn sure. And beheaded. I love how I can behead a ghost. Kind of funny to me, just a tad. And another one, goodbye. <laughs> And another one. Goodbye. Oh my god. And goodbye. <laughs> that never gets old. Good lord. God, there's just so many ectoplasm piles everywhere. It's perfect. Dude, I'm 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 pretty I'm pretty enthralled in this mod already, guys. And we're only about an hour through this so far and we're only we're only like through the second room. This is actually really cool. Like I, I kind of like this room. I like this room for a thumbnail picture. You know how I do. You know how I am. I like this. It's got good lighting. It's got good coloring and all that good stuff. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. All right, good stuff. Let's keep moving. But yeah, I'm definitely digging this mod, guys. And I hope you are too, because I'm definitely digging this whole entire mod. And so far, it's pretty freaking cool. Let's see. So this is what I'm talking about, guys. I got to look around this whole entire area if I want to find all the stuff. Because... There might be a lever, there might be a button, oh my god, more? There might be like a, like a chain or something. God, there's so many ghosts, that's crazy. Like back here is prime real estate for chains and buttons and stuff. Oh, F like that, good lord. Didn't your mama ever tell you not to sneak up on people? Good lord. I need you guys to back up, please, Jesus. Or just melt, all of you. Oh my god, I did. I melted all of them simultaneously. That was amazing. Yeah, see, there's like... That is prime real estate for that. Oh, and I think I just got myself stuck. There's a lot of places for you to get stuck, I'll tell you that. There we go. Okay, I got myself out. Okay. So, yeah. I'm looking like, uh... Okay, good stuff. So it's not looking like there's any buttons or chains or levers around here, guys. But I am, however... I am, however, I am going to go ahead and end off today's episode right here, guys, because we are all out of time for today's episode, but, guys, I am straight up getting excited about this mod, and I hope you guys are too, because if today's episode is any precursor of the puzzles and uh, things to come, then get ready, because it's going to stump me, I can pretty much guarantee that, and uh, it's going to be a ton of fun, guys. So, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And if you did, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, follow me on Twitter at CouchPotato1898. And I will see you guys in the next video.